Today I'm unveiling a game called Fates Forever, which is a reinterpretation of the multiplayer online battle arena genre exclusively for tablets. I mean, Disrupt is a perfect venue because we are disrupting the way that core games are played. I am so proud of what we made. The trailer we put together, it's like a minute of just pure awesome. So even if the whole presentation bombs, I have at least one minute that I know people will like. <laughs> so next up, we've got Fates Forever, and presenting is Jason Chitron. In a MOBA, you play on teams of three in real-time combat with the objective of destroying your opponent's base. So let me show you. So how do you get people using it? <laughs> right. Well, it starts by building a great game. Yep. You put it on the App Store. You spend a bunch of marketing money to get initial user set. So I just finished the presentation, and I picked up my phone. This is my notification list right after the presentation of people on Twitter texting me, emails, just being like, cool job, pretty cool. Um, we debuted a trailer on stage as part of the presentation, and the pickup and response has just been phenomenal. I was out in the startup alley showing off the game to people and kind of wave them over and they come, come up to the table and want to play a video game and they start touching it and, and people immediately respond viscerally to, the, to the, how beautiful it is. So this is a uh, multiplayer online battle arena. Like Dota. Dota. Like Dota. Oh, I'm, oh, I'm a God. crazy programmer. It's beautiful, man. I mean, I think what impresses me about the other five finalists is that a couple of them are solving problems that are like fundamental to humanity. And we're building video games, which is awesome, and people need entertainment, and they always have, and it's a way to like keep people satisfied and happy with their lives. But, um, you know, one guy is solving wireless power, like that's really cool. That would fundamentally change so much about how we use all the technology around us. Last night, my phone rings, and I look at it, and I freeze, and I'm like, I think this is it. 